and he's, um, I'm sure he's well prepared. And, um, you know, the fact that, you know, and he really said it to me, the first piece of advice I would give is just hit the ground running, you know, and uh, attack each day, every day can be a day of improvement. And, uh, and but he already said it, he already knows it. So, um, Again, uh, it's, a, it's a happy day. It's a day of, day of celebration for us. Were you as shocked as the rest of us that the job opened up in the first place? Um, yeah, yeah. Very you know, surprised. Uh, had a great relationship with John Beeline. Uh, you know, really liked John a lot and uh, admired the job that he did. And, you know, like everybody was, was surprised uh, when he wasn't here. And, um, and wish him well. Uh, very good friend. Lives right Probably about a nine iron away from my house. So, uh, but uh, I'm really proud of Ward Manuel. I think he did a tremendous job. Uh, the, the timing, the execution, the decisiveness, and uh, you know the the person that he hired. Uh, everything just makes it a happy day. Makes it a day of celebration. Thanks, Jim. Yep. Hey, Jim, I know you're big on uh, social media. I tweeted about Joan Howard. We never tweeted about. Jim, or John Beeline, people seem to be fired up about that. Can you kind of say why or why, why tweet about one and not the other? No, I think most people understood. I mean, I'm very good friends with John Beeline and uh, have tremendous respect for Coach Beeline. And uh, I've had a lot of learning experiences uh, watching him coach. He lives about a nine iron from my house. Um, that was, but I'm happy for Jawan Howard, happy for, uh, for Ward Manuel. Uh, really proud of the, the job that Ward did the decisiveness, the uh, the execution uh, of this hiring, and, and today you know you see it. You see that uh, you know the right man was chosen. Ward did the the uh, did a great job leading this this search in this university. So uh, and I'm happy happy about that, and, and wish Coach Beeline nothing but success. And, uh, you know, been a been a fabulous man, and now we got a we got a, a fabulous man to. Uh, uh, take his place. As a Michigan man, was it important for you to see another Michigan man take this job? No, just the right man. You know, that's uh, that's the uh, the thing that I'm really, really happy and proud of. Ward man. What uh, makes him the right man? Um, you can see it today. I, 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 I could see it. I could, I could feel it. The uh, you know, the the passion for the job. The uh, the, uh, the the family man that he is. The, the Michigan man that he is. I think all those things are. You know, I don't think it's all any. I don't think it's one thing. I don't think it's just being a Michigan man. But, um, like I said, I think this is to me a lot about Ward Manuel today. Mm -hmm. That's that's what's that's what I feel. Uh, I'm really proud of him. He did a tremendous job in this hiring. Um, the timing, the execution of it, and the decisiveness. Yeah. And, and I trust Ward. I know Ward. Uh, and I know that he was. He looked at a lot of people, and he hired the. The one he thought was best for Michigan, and that's that's why it's a day of celebration. No what concerns about uh, no head coaching experience. I trust Ward. I trust Ward Manuel. <laughs> um, you know, he's uh, all the things that that they they talked about today. How they're they're getting to know each other and uh, realizing what kind of men they uh, each are. I mean, I've had that relationship with Ward uh, three years in this position, him athletic director and me head coach. Um, and also the um, lucky enough to know him from our college playing days. But uh, and he's a great athletic director. And he's, a, he's a tremendous leader for this athletic department. So yes, I trust him. I trust. I trust the job he did. I'm really impressed by it that uh, he executed this in a decisive way. And I know he found the right man. You said that's, scary. That's where my trust is. Scary good off season. What makes it, what makes it a scary good off season? Scary good uh, to me is uh, when you know things are, you know they're 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 going good, and um, you know the law of averages will catch up with you at some point. But you just work really hard to try to keep it going as long as possible. So yeah, that's things are really good. Things are good with the football team. Uh, things are great with my family, and uh, things are great here at the University of Michigan. What can you tell Jawan about being an alum and coming in? Is there extra pressure? Is it harder? And how can you help him? How can you help him out with uh, with that? Well, my, my, my advice would have been what he said today. And um, 
first thing I would have said was just hit the ground running and and uh, and start working and make every day a day of improvement, every act an act of improvement, and uh, and he already said it. So uh, he's uh, he's right on the right track. What do you remember about the Fab Five and those guys? Did you check them out at all when you were? You know, yeah. I know you were playing and busy, but what, what do you remember about those days? Um, yeah, I mean, I've always I've always loved coming here. Uh, as a ten year old kid, um, my dad got tickets uh, to watch basketball games for the for the family, and 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. Then we then we moved away and watched on TV, and then came back here in college. I was this was a this was a thing to do to come to a Michigan home basketball game and cherish the, the opportunity to come to them. Now this is a tremendous place, and um, yeah, just I've always loved the Michigan basketball program. Antoine Jobert, great seeing him today. We were classmates in 1982. We both graduated high school and both came here uh, to Michigan. Gary Grant, other guys that I that I went to school with, and and um, you know the great tradition as Juwan talked about today. Uh, of Michigan basketball and the University of Michigan and, and John Beeline and becoming really close friends with him. I mean, it's been, uh, this is this is a special place. There's, there's no question about it. So, and I'm really, really celebrate today that, that uh, you know, we have a, a great man to lead our basketball program and, and have complete trust in Ward Manuel. He's, knowing him as athletic director for three years and me as head football coach, he is really good. And uh, this is impressive. This is impressive. This search, uh, his timing, his execution, and uh, his decisiveness uh, to bring who he feels is the best man to lead our basketball program. Uh, it makes it a day of celebration for us. Thanks. Thank you, guys. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.